Ladies and gentlemen, I am proud to announce that Cold War Year 2 is officially beginning. So not too long ago, Cold War got an update and with this, data miners and leakers were finally able to get into the files and see what we are going to be getting. And it's safe to say that Cold War is getting good content. So the first thing I'm going to say is we are going to be getting two new weapons. Yes, two new weapons. A scythe, which is absolutely insane. And may I add, there will be a bundle where you will be able to unlock this scythe straight away. And this bundle will include a certain operator from zombies being Ravenov. Yes, I'm sorry for unloading this onto you right now, but we are going to be getting a brand new melee weapon, which is the scythe and also a operator for Cold War, which is Ravenov. If you don't know who Ravenov is, he's a really big part of the Cold War zombie storyline and he was actually one of the leaked characters or sorry operators for the actual upcoming content that we're going to be getting. On top of this we're also supposed to be receiving Raptor 1 which is a big one, Peck and also Kravchenko but those aren't confirmed apart from the Ravnov one which was found in the files and the new ranged weapon is going to be an AR called the Vargo 52 AR which will also receive a Mastercraft. Now my best guess is either tomorrow which is going to be the 10th of February February is most likely going to be a day we will be receiving one of these content drops inside of Cold War if it's either the new AR or the Ravenov bundle with the brand new scythe. I'm pretty sure on top of being able to purchase the weapons it will follow the same style of being able to go in and complete a certain challenge. I'll be making videos on that but on top of this we also received information about two new multiplayer maps. One of them which is a map from Black Ops 1 remade and it is called WMD and also a map called Jungle. The Jungle one seems to be not in the files yet and also something I forgot to mention all of this information is gotten from totally not Alex on Twitter links down below if you want to see these images if you want to see everything I can't show it to you because it is leaked and probably one of the biggest things that came out of it in my opinion out of the leaks and everything is that there's a small chance a small chance according to Alex that we will be receiving a zombies map on Cold War yes another addition to zombies map now this could be round base or out break or my best guess is if it's not two of those it could potentially just be an addition to onslaught with the multiplayer maps that will be coming out since you know onslaught has multiplayer maps so yes on top of all of the crazy information that we have gotten for season two of vanguard we are going to be getting more content for cold war so on top of the bad content that we might get we might get some bangers in cold war to hop back on unlock dark ether or new ar new aside check out the new ravenov bundle check out the new multiplayer maps and maybe in the future we might be seeing a brand new zombies map fingers crossed maybe there's a small chance it is part of zombies chronicles 2 but it's it's very slim once again all the leaked information and everything will be down in the description uh, if you want to check out the images of the weapons and stuff like that i'll see you guys in the next one peace out <laughs>